Howdy, Monique Walker here with Remax Excalibur. Welcome back to my Phoenix, Arizona real estate video blog where I'm bringing you relevant uh, real estate topics to our local market here. So today I'm here to share with you what buyers, sellers, and homeowners need to know about our real estate market today. My clients are always asking me, Monique, how is the market? And Monique, what do you foresee will happen in the future? So that's exactly why I wanted to create this short um, video so that I could answer those questions for you. So one of the most important ways to understand the market is to understand the absorption rate of any, any community or of the valley as a whole. So our market here in Phoenix has 22,000 properties and we sold 7,000 last month. So we take the number of active listings, 22, divide that by the number of sold, which is 7,000, and we come up with a number of 3.26. So that allows us to measure the supply and demand, right, of our market. So the industry standard is if that number is anything less than a five, then we're considered uh, in a seller's market. Since Phoenix is at a 3.26, we are in a strong seller's market. You know, we have 3.26 month supply of homes um, if no other homes come on the market. So good news. Next, another important factor to know is the amount of distressed properties on the market. Back in 09 and 10, we had between 70 to 80% of our market be short sales, bank owned properties. And I'm so happy to report now that we only have 30% of our market now is distressed properties, whether bank owned or short sales. Another reason why our market's actually recovering and recovering at a very rapid speed. So our business fortunately has um, increased as well. Uh, in 2011, we were able to help 70 families. In 2012, we were able to help 88 families. So what does this mean? What does this mean for buyers? Okay. So what I'm noticing is that my buyers, when they go out to purchase, they only have about five to eight homes, quality homes to really look at in any given area, whether you're looking in say central Phoenix or you're looking at Arcadia, you know, that's basically the number that I'm noticing. Um, so buyers, if you're, if you see a property that you like, go for it because it might not be there next time. And what does this mean for sellers? Well, because of our, our decrease in supply, we're noticing that prices are going up, right? Great. So if you're thinking about selling, price your property right so you can get yourself a bunch of showings and possibly um, get multiple offers. You know, again, if your property's in good condition and at the right price. Those are my two disclaimers, okay? And homeowners, um, what should you know? Well, what I'm noticing is that our buyers are paying top dollar for upgrades. So if you've been thinking about, you know, remodeling your kitchen, baths, including more um, backyard or living area to the backyard, which a lot of people want, want fireplaces, barbecues, you know, ramadas, I would say do it because buyers are now paying top dollar for those extra upgrades and features. And eventually when you go to sell in the next couple of years, you will most likely get your money back. Okay. So again, what did we talk about? Number one, we're in a seller's market. You know, number two, Phoenix has very little distressed properties, which is now allowing our market to recover and prices are going up. Great, huh? So this is um, what buyers, sellers, homeowners need to know about our, our market and what's going to happen throughout the year. So, you know, I invite you to forward this email uh, video blog to anybody that you think that would benefit from, you know, knowing this information that's looking to buy, sell, is just interested in it. And if you're looking to buy or sell, call me. I know that I could help you. Uh, thank you again for watching. I will see you next time.